Hi, I'm Connie. I'm the teen librarian at San Francisco Public Library. And today, um, I will be continuing our show and tell featuring BrainFuse. BrainFuse is our free online tutoring service. And today, I'm going to show you how to access it on your desktop, laptop, phone, or tablet. First thing you're going to need is your library card. So once you have your library card, on the back of your card is the barcode. You're gonna need those numbers and you're gonna need your secret pin. If you don't have a card, if you can't find your card, if you don't remember your pin, just reach out to us. We're standing by to help. How do I get to Brain Fuse? Big question. So first thing you're gonna need to do is get to San Francisco Public Library's homepage and that is gonna be sfpl.org. So we're gonna go ahead. And on this homepage, you're gonna click on the Research and Learn tab. And then you're gonna click on e-learning. This is gonna take you to a new page with all the e-resources offerings from SFPL. BrainFuse is the first thing on that page. And once you click on it, it should take you to an authentication page if you're accessing this from home. This is when you want to, use, to enter in your library card number and that secret PIN number. Once you do so, it's gonna take you to BrainFuse's homepage. Do I need an account for live help? No, you absolutely do not need an account for live help. Live tutoring is available from 1 p.m. to 10 p.m. daily and you're just gonna click on that live tutoring tab, select the grade, select the subject, and it's gonna connect you to the right smart person to get you the help you need. Why do I need an account? Well, if you have a question at say 10 a.m., midnight, or you need a paper that needs proofreading, or you want to practice for your SATs or ACTs, well, an account's gonna help with that. And signing up for an account is super easy. All you need is a username and password. So we're gonna go in to the top right-hand corner and click on the login screen. And you're gonna click on sign up. And all you're gonna do is enter that username and password. BrainFuse is not gonna take any personal information. So you don't need to put in your real name, your address, your phone number, your birthday, none of that. It's just your whatever username you like and the password. And once you've created an account, you can now use BrainFuse on your phone. Can I access BrainFuse on my phone? Absolutely. You can go on your phone and access your favorite internet app, whether it's Safari, Chrome, Firefox, Google, and get onto sfpl.org and follow instructions from earlier. So let's do it on our phone. So we're gonna go on SFPL and just follow all those instructions and get on BrainFuse. How do I access the app? Well, you're gonna take your phone and you're gonna to go to whichever app store you have. You're gonna type in BrainFuse. There's only one in BrainFuse, so it shouldn't be hard, confusing. And you're gonna download that app and once you've got that downloaded, you can go to your home screen and hit the BrainFuse app. It's gonna take you to that home page where you're gonna type in that username and password. Once you've got that typed in, it's gonna take you to a screen where you can access all the help you need, whether it's live help, a writing lab, or you need to check your message center, see if your tutor answered that question you needed answering, or even keep track of all your homework assignments. So thanks for learning. Remember students, we are here for you. You can always reach us at email, info at sfpl.org, or you can call us at 415-557-4400. Bye.